I also just want to uh, thank my colleagues for uh, endorsing, um, for co-sponsoring, I'm sorry, the um, resolution in opposition to a citizenship question on the 2020 uh, the, um, decennial census. And, you know, many of us worked very hard um, at the last census to make sure that all segments of our community um, understood the importance of participating in this uh, exercise and uh, because there are so many important uh, decisions that are made uh, with regards to budget allocation, resources that we need, uh, so many different ways that this information is used for to calculate different formulas. Um, we uh, have seen uh, and heard, of course, that uh, uh, since 1950, uh, the census has not asked a citizenship question of uh, the participants. And so uh, it was uh, quite disturbing to uh, realize that this is something that is being um, proposed and that the Department of Justice is requesting uh, an, an, ad, an addition of a citizenship question. Now this has a lot of obviously negative consequences, especially in a county like Montgomery that has uh, about 33% of its population is foreign born. And um, you know, it, it really does, I think, work against our goal of ensuring uh, maximum participation in the census. And so we have, uh, with this resolution that's been introduced, um, basically what we're saying is that, that we are supporting Maryland Attorney General Brian Frosch's decision to join a coalition of 19 attorney generals and the state of Colorado and urging the U.S. Department of Commerce to reject ad the addition of a citizenship question to the 2020 census. And uh, we also urge Attorney um, General Frosch to join at least 12 other states in suing the uh, to stop the addition of a citizenship question uh, on the 2020 census, either as part of a multi-state lawsuit or by initiating one on behalf of the state of Maryland. Uh, so once again, I really do appreciate my colleagues' um, support, uh, and I hope that we are successful um, in sending a strong message of support of our Attorney General um, to stop this really um, unnecessary uh, question that only works against uh, counties like ours and so many other counties across the nation um, to basically deny resources that are absolutely necessary for us to do the work that we need to do. Thank you.